Good day everyone. I just want to make this video to clarify things and clarify things to, to state that everything that I mentioned with regards to the article on the Pfizer-BioNTech uh, vaccine being approved uh, by the FDA for normal use, that, that it's 100% uh, correct and that it stands. And that if you go and read the paper correctly and exactly as the article lays out, so in other words, the article was uh, factually accurate, that the Comunarty uh, product was registered as the product that will now go out and uh, represent this Pfizer-BioNTech uh, vaccine and that people will be able to use that and, and um, basically supply it as a normal fully approved product. Now, where people got confused, the Pfizer-BioNTech uh, vaccine that's been distributed all over the world still needs to uh, be available in the places where it's being applied. And therefore, the emergency use was extended for that until such time as the Comunarty uh, product is available as an entity. So a lot of people, I think, got confused by not reading the, the papers properly. And um, yes, I suppose a person can very easily dive into something if you want to read something. Um, that you want to read and, and not actually read what is being said. And this is a, a normal trait amongst people that want a specific outcome. You will try and look for the outcome that you want. And um, this also applies to um, the, the science field uh, and the medical field in general, where people, if you are funded to actually try and find a certain outcome, uh, then you will look for that outcome and might be very likely to then to find something that uh, corroborates that specific outcome instead of just being an open scientist or, or medical person that will literally just look at real science. And in this case, it's, it is clear that a simple piece of paper that actually has a whole lot of legal jargon and, and various other things that people might find difficult to read is very plain and simple in saying that there is a new product uh, being formulated that has been approved and uh, that this new product uh, has a very specific name, Comunarty. And uh, I don't know where the name comes from or why that name is used, but that is how the Pfizer-BioNTech uh, vaccine will be marketed. It will be marketed as Comunarty and it's Comunarty that's been approved uh, for full use uh, with the FDA and then the Pfizer-BioNTech vaccine, which is one and the same thing, uh, can continue under emergency use as it has, has already been marketed as such. And this full approval is only given from ages 16 and up. So uh, an extension had to be given for ages 15 down to the age of 12. And all of this was mentioned in that article. So none of it was left out. All the details were there for you to actually understand uh, exactly what was said. And so you maybe need to think about uh, how you read an article, how you question things. And you know, it's very good that a person makes the effort to actually go and find the source material and actually read it, but it's even better if you understand or comprehend uh, what is said in the source material. So, yes, all of us can improve in doing something like that. Some people ask me to do a follow-up because I got it wrong, uh, that they were only given the extension, but this is not true. Uh, full approval was given uh, for Comunarty. I mentioned Comunarty and that the full approval was given to Comunarty. Also, um, where the confusion came in is that they extended the emergency use of the Pfizer-BioNTech, which was not the topic of the article. And I think maybe that's where people didn't read further and get into the detail. So maybe there's a lesson to be learned from this. Please read everything before commenting. The same as watching the entire video that I make before commenting. It always helps. And, um, you know, I've done many foolish things in my life. And fortunately, I learn from them and then adapt and make sure that I get into the nitty gritty 
of the detail because that's where you make the difference and hopefully that is a difference that this channel has made is getting into the nitty gritty kicking out the riffraff and hopefully uh, keeping things that are helpful and that will make a difference in your life thank you very much till the next video